Well, hello, my brothers and sisters. Hello, my brothers and sisters. If I can say this, is that um, what I'm seeing, what I'm seeing and what has taken place among the church, among the church world, among just um, just all that's in the church, around the church, is there's two things that's happening. And But what's going to happen is that God is going to reveal what's who's real, what's true, and he's going to expose, expose what's phony. If you notice, the Bible also says that the devil comes as an angel of light. In other words, he's an imitator. And so what's happening is that you, you're seeing a lot of imitators. You see a lot, you're seeing a lot of pretenders. And, and this is, this is, this is, it's like a showdown between, uh, God and Baal. And the God that answers by fire will be the true God. And so you have a lot of witchcraft that's done come up and you have a lot of people that are prophesying, prophesying and doing all kind of stuff. And it's a comp it's a comp competitive thing. It's a demonic thing. It's witchcraft trying to compete. The Bible says that the spirit lusts against the flesh and the flesh lusts against the spirit. It's always a comp competitive thing. There's a warfare. And so this is what's happening. And so um, what's going to take place is those people who are true and full of God and walking in the substance of God and, and walking righteous before God, signs and wonders are going to follow them. Healings are going to take place. Miracles are going to take place. Deliverance is going to take place. But those that are fake and phony, those that don't have substance, those that are doing a whole lot of talking, but there's no action, there's no show, there's no demonstration, there's no power, they're going to be just like an echo. They're going to be just like a sound. They're going to be almost like, if I can use an example, how um, Samson was when his power had left, when he shook himself, he didn't have nothing. Many are going to shake themselves and they ain't going to have nothing. Many bishops, apostles, evangelists, pastors, and teachers, they're going to shake themselves and they ain't going to have nothing. And many are like Eli when called, God was calling Samson. Um, Samson. Eli knew what God sounded like. He was going blind. He knew what God sounded like. God was speaking to him no more. So because he knew what God sounded like, he was able to instruct um, Samuel. So this is what's happening to a, my, many of the older ministers and ministries and stuff like that and teachers who's lost their way, who's disobeyed God and God, the light of their eyes have went out. They know what God sounds like. And so they're going by the echoes of what they once knew the echoes of what they want sound or what they once heard and this is what they're, they're a lot of the the ones that are blind are doing they're getting around people young preachers young prophets and and listening to their conversation with god and they're learning what god is saying through them so you got a lot of tricky stuff that's going on but god is going to reveal who is true god he's going to reveal who's of him who has him in him and he's going to reveal and show who's not of him and it's going to become by the fruit the Bible says you'll know them by the fruit, and fruit is what they're producing. What are you producing? Are you producing love? Are you producing hate? Are you producing power? What are you producing? What is your fruit? This is what's happening, and this is what's taking place. And so you're going to see a turn. You're going to see uh, uh, even more stuff exposed, more people exposed, uh, being uncovered. God is uncovering unrighteousness. God is uncovering sin. God is uncovering in wickedness. God is bringing judgment in many areas and many levels at many stages. And it's just the beginning. It's just the beginning. God bless you. Have a good day.